Hi. Thank you, everyone, for letting me know that um, Jenny McCarthy has resigned. Okay, so I've looked at Jenny McCarthy's before. I don't understand why she resigned. There's were uh, all of that. I just don't understand it. She's Yang Metal, she sits on the rat. But then I just uh, I asked somebody and they said that he threw her under the bus in the inquiry yesterday. So he said it was her and another guy, Pakop, Pakula, whatever his name is. I haven't done his chart. But with her chart, she's Yang Metal and she sits on the rat. Now, Yang Metal sitting on the rat is moralistic. It's virtuous. They are the judge and the jury. It, they, it, they would feel sick when they've done something wrong, if they've done something wrong. They can't live with themselves, etc., cetera, et cetera. So it, this is why I don't understand that she resigned. She should have just dobbed him in. But she didn't expect him to throw her under the bus, okay? So she's that, the moralistic, the virtuous side of her stuck by him. You're an idiot, mate. Homer Simpson, you're an idiot. Even Homer's better. Anyway, so he's replaced her. So the metal that she is sitting on the rack is what the year is. So she's mimicking the year and she's challenged this year. And so she's challenged, which means for her to speak or say anything becomes very, very hard. And you can see that from when she's asked a question. She just can't. When she should say it's him, the idiot, she doesn't, okay? But you know what? <laughs> She's going to come back, mate, because she is in such harmony once January comes in. She is in such harmony. She's got three months to put it all together and come back and tell us what really happened. Boing. Yeah. I'm really pissed off with him. Um, she's in 10 years of metal on metal. She's 51 and at 52 it changes. So it just came in earlier because it is a monkey. The monkey and the rat she sits on is harmonious. So she's got to speak, but she wasn't speaking. She has to say what she knows. She has to say what is going on, but she didn't, okay? So I'm kind of repeating this because, um, yeah, it's I don't know where it is. So anyway... The 10 years she's in is also a monkey. So then this month has pushed her and pushed her and she didn't do it. She didn't speak. Even in an inquiry, she did not speak, right? She held on to what everybody else said. I don't know. I don't know. That kind of thing. Big mistake for you, Jen. That's your mistake. Now, she's been replaced by a guy called Foley. So I don't know, again, I didn't know who Jenny was till I did her chart a while ago. I did it. She's just the health minister to me. So and then I um, uh, I don't know who this Foley is either, but I just needed his birthday. I got his birthday. So he replaced her. But he didn't ask for it. Homer Simpson called him and said, do you want the job? I asked. He said, I rang and asked him. Yeah, he didn't, uh, he said he didn't ask her to resign, but that was the right course of action. For what? For you to stay and Gestapo this whole state? Yeah, that's how it is. Anyway, Foley is Yin Wood. The Yin Wood sits on the rabbit. The rabbit and Homer's uh, dog are bromance. Oh, <laughs> another bromance. Oh, they're Ewans. Do you know what Ewans are, mate? They're soulmates. But soulmates are not life partners. Soulmates are here to teach you the lesson. And if you don't learn, yeah, so Scott Morrison couldn't teach you the lesson. You didn't learn. Why do you not learn? Because you're you, airs rock on airs rock. And nothing, nothing can move this, nothing. So that's how stubborn, obsessed and you, you your head is. It's you're like this blinkers. That's who you are. You know we are positive. We are optimistic. Who's we? Pale face? Not me. No, I am. But you know what I mean. Anyway, so every day you come out here and you tell us 
uh, 51 um, positives today um, uh, and uh, four deaths and now we're all in aged care. Yeah. How positive is that? Far out. Anyway, the person you've replaced her with, right, is Yinwood on a rabbit. So that Yinwood on a rabbit is bromance, but you don't get it. You have chosen someone that Jenny would not speak, but this one, oh, he will be Twittering, he will be Instagramming. Anyone that wants to know who upset him, he's going to tell them. <laughs> you're going to wish, you're going to wish Jen was still there, mate. That's right. So this guy, he's got 14 days of crap, so I can't see why you even chose him. Next month, he's not too bad next month. He's got a little bit of harmony, not the best, but then he's in penalty and clash in November. Then he's in penalty in December. And then next year, the yin medal that comes in chops him down. So he won't resign. Someone will throw him out or under the bus again. You're an idiot, Foley. Get out while you can because you know what? He's going to put you under the bus. Oh. Anyway, so with this guy, Foley, his life changed at... Um, 57, his life changed, and there's a lot of pressure on him. Then let's add next year with more pressure. <laughs> let's add the next few months with pressure. Yeah, you should just resign now, mate, and get it over and done with, and that's it. So that's all I can tell you guys, and I put it on this because, yeah, I just... <sighs> And the other is what I, I get on and get things done. I don't run from challenges. No, you throw somebody else under the bus for it. You know, Earth has 10 things going at once, but he's Earth on Earth. So he will have 20 things going at once and he will not finish one. That's it. I don't know him for a bar of soap. Thank God. <laughs> anyway. So um, never wanted to leave a job unfinished. <laughs> oh, anyway, I got to go now. Do some real bloody work. <laughs> Have a great weekend, everyone. I'm still upset.